Welcome. I want to show you a great stretch that can remove that crazy, dizzy, giddy, unbalanced feeling that many of us get. Now we're saying, where is it coming from? Very commonly for people who have poor posture that spends a lot of time in a forward position, the muscles underneath the occipital area contract and squeeze, affecting nerves that go back up into the head and brain region. By doing this specific type of technique, we can reduce that contracture, allow the area to move properly again, and hopefully get a lot of irritation off those nerves that's causing those crazy symptoms. Many of you have already seen my suboccipital technique to reduce that tension behind the skull, to reduce those headaches, the pressure, the neck pain. This is similar, but what makes this different is that we're going to bring our chin into a chin tuck like this, straight back. From the side, just like this, straight back. So as we do that chin tuck, we're working the anterior deep flexors. That helps support forward head posture if you're someone that spends a lot of time looking down. So what I want you to do is bring yourself into a chin tuck, straight back, keep your chin level with the ground, grab underneath the skull. Now what I want you to do, I don't want your chin to touch your chest as the other technique we talked about in the suboccipital stretch. What I want you to do here is bring your chin straight back and grab underneath the skull. And as you hold it back, I want you to pull, keep your chin back, pull up and around like this, up and around. So you're gonna pull this way, keep it back, and pull up and around. Keep that chin tucked in, and pull up and around and hold it there, a good 20 to 25 seconds. Now, we're gonna bring our chin to the right, keep a chin tuck, keep it in there, do not put your chin on your chest, and come up and around. And now what you're gonna do is you're gonna feel that stretch directly underneath the back of the skull. Good, up and around. You should, you should not feel the stretch between your shoulder blades, just above, below the skull, above the upper neck, below the skull. Turn to the left, chin tuck, hold it in that chin tuck position. Grab underneath the skull, pull up and around. Pull up and around. Feel that stretch, beautiful. Keep that chin tuck. Good. You should only feel it in the suboccipital area on the upper part of the neck. Now, just to make sure you're doing the technique right, now put your chin on your chest. This is not what I want you to do for the technique, but this is what I don't want you to do for this. So you'll understand that if you're doing the technique wrong, this will explain why. Put your chin on your chest. Now pull up and around. Now you're gonna feel it down in between your shoulder blades. We don't want you to feel it in your shoulder blades. We want you to feel it strictly below the base of the skull. So do this technique. Do it daily if it helps you, twice a day. It's safe. You're just releasing those tight muscles. Remember, you can practice those chin tucks. You can do repetitions of 10 per set. You could do a couple sets every other day of those but the stretch is gonna reduce that muscle contracture and hopefully get those nerves and get the function working correctly underneath the base of the skull region. I hope this technique really helps you to get you more stable, give you more balance, not make you feel that giddy, that dizzy, that weird sensation that I can't even explain to you. I get hundreds of emails, people ask me about this over and over and over. Been to doctors, no one can find anything, well, I hope this is magic for you. Share this video with your friends, subscribe, and most important, make it a great day. I'm Dr. Alan Mandel.